Team Hell No had a great run, but like most tag teams, Keen and I eventually went our separate ways, and I returned to pursuing my goal of winning singles titles. I need to win the WWE Championship. It was around this time I had a series of matches with Randy Orton that would have a much greater effect on my career than I could ever imagine. I put a lot of pressure on myself during this because Randy was really the first real top, top guy that I had a rivalry with. If I could do well with Randy, that puts you even to another level. I felt I had a lot to prove, which led to some very hard-hitting and physical contests. I got pretty banged up, but I was determined to fight through it and not let it slow me down. So much so that I went on to face Randy Orton in a street fight rematch on Raw. It's gotta be hard to rebound from that one. Wow, talk about knowing where you're at at all times. The drop kick hits the target. Gets him with the fist. Oh, what a kick! They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. He's inflicting some serious pain here. I'll be shocked if that's not it. I'm not surprised that Randy Orton couldn't make it as a tag team partner for Daniel Bryan. He hasn't had the best track record with allies this year. That's true, Byron. Orton put his neck out for the Big Show to help him and Sheamus take on the Shield at WrestleMania. That match ended with Big Show punching out both his partners. You two gentlemen mentioned Orton's bad luck with tag partners. After Big Show's betrayal, Sheamus and Orton couldn't get along. It's a minor miracle that Orton helped Team Hell No beat the Shield. Needless to say, I don't think we'll be seeing Orton teaming up with anyone in that locker room for quite some time after tonight. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Randy Orton and Daniel Bryan are both as tough as they come, and this is a matter of pride between both men. These are two guys you don't want to lose, especially to each other. Look, we did see things get heated earlier tonight, but I think there's still a level of respect here. Neither is going to cheat to defeat the other. It's all about proving that you are the best. This could be it. Guys, Bryan has Orton really. The so-called weak link is edging even closer to a victory. It would be a massive upset if Bryan beat Roxon with a series of kicks. Game, set, match, this one is over. Yeah, that was lightning quick. Saxton, you were blathering about these guys being respectful, and I gotta dispute you. Orton's done some despicable things to get ahead, and Bryan certainly wasn't respectful when he cashed in money in the bank on the big show. You do what you can to get ahead in this industry. Corey, that's all in the past. The WWE Universe loves both these guys because they're all about competition. Not stable in play. This rivalry between Daniel Bryan and Randy Orton has been simmering for weeks and looks to violently explode during this street fight. Uh, Bryan has been determined to show he can beat Orton. Last week on Raw, Randy Orton won the match via ref stoppage when Bryan injured his arm. Bryan got a cutout win four days later on SmackDown, but he wants a definitive win over the Viper here tonight. We recounted Daniel Bryan and Randy Orton's matches as of late. We thought it would be settled in tonight's opening match, but they brawled to a double disqualification. Well, you won't see a count out, DQ, or an injury in this match. One of these guys is going to be pinned or submitted at the conclusion of this street fight. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. And Randy Orton just slips out of harm's way. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. Daniel Bryan has been consumed with the idea that he's a weak link due to his performances in 
tag team competition as of late. Well, Brian tends to be consumed by just about... It could be over here! This is it! He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Not yet. Bringing back up Daniel Bryan as a weak link. Note that he's not sorry he let Kane down when he cost Team Hell No the tag titles. Or that he failed Randy Orton in their quest for the tag titles. Brian's just thinking about himself here. Look, Brian may have faltered in those matches, but Brian was also the guy who got Seth Rollins to tap out for the Shield's first ever six-man tag team loss. He can obviously be a team player, but right now, Brian is out to prove he's a single superstar. Oh, I think this man needs business. We saw Team Hell No dissolve last week on Raw as both Kane and Daniel Bryan turned their sights towards the WWE Championship. Step one in that process is beating Randy Orton. Defeating a guy of Orton's stature puts you near the front of the line for title opportunities. Drop kick! Great athleticism. Going back to Kane and Daniel Bryan. Brings down his opponent, and here it is, Corey! It's oh, in oh, what's in. What's Randy Orton gonna do? Will the Viper tap out? Orton's in serious trouble. Oh, Trying to drag himself to the ropes, but remember, the ropes aren't gonna cause a break oh, here. Guys, guys. Because this is a street fight, and Orton with a kendo oh. stick. Oh. Oh. Repeated strikes with a kendo stick. Orton wearing the weapon out on Daniel Bryan's just, body. Just what the WWE's Apex Predator needs is a weapon. It's all perfectly legal. And you will find absolutely... Oh, my God! No remorse whatsoever from Randy Orton. All the frustration inside the Viper bubbling over. Orton's like a man possessed. This won't end well. And he's got Bryan on the second rope. Randy Orton could be closing in on a victory. Oh, vintage Orton with a DDT. I think that's the beginning of the end, gentlemen. Randy Orton seems to be preparing to go to that place. Randy Orton is focused. Randy Orton could be closing in on victory. Looking for the RKO. No, back slide by Bryan. Shoulders are down. Orton kicks out. Oh, and a kick by Daniel Bryan, and now Kendo stick in hand. Oh, and Bryan. Bryan unloading on Orton. Bryan returning the favor. Randy Orton's methodical attacks are starting to take their toll on the man he considers a weak link, Daniel Bryan. Bryan's defeated many top WWE stars, but beating a guy the caliber of Orton may... Shoulders down! And he kicks out. Still too fresh. Can't believe it. He's too quick for him there. And here comes Randy Orton unleashes the RKO, and it's all over but the crying. This one's over, guys. Wow, I can't believe he had the energy to kick out of that. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. I don't want to know what that feels like. Nice job by Randy Orton there. Can he score the pin? Oh, uh, maybe. And he's able to get out. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. And he finds a way free. Wow. That was just pure determination, Cole. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. 
He's inflicting some serious pain here. Oh, I think this man needs business. Cover here. Real nicely done. I can't believe he's in this. How'd he do that? And here comes Orton. Whoa, did you see what he just did? Incredible. Close line right to the back of the neck. Randy Orton has found an answer here. up big with the reversal. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Look at him. And that one drops him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. Great move. The Viper getting absolutely pounded right now. Oh, Daniel Bryan no! using the kendo oh, stick for no! leverage. And oh. Orton taps out. Randy Orton taps out. What a win for Daniel Bryan. Career-defining win for Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan with one of the biggest victories of his career. Yeah, we knew it was going to be a physically grueling battle between Daniel Bryan and Randy Orton. And boy, did Bryan earn this. Got to give it up to him. Got to give it up to Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan's going to be feeling the effects of this one for some time. Oh, hold, hold on. Orton offering a sign of respect. That's what you love to see. Two great superstars, two great warriors displaying their mutual respect for each other. Drops out. Yeah.